Hi, hello mga kadasi. Welcome to my YouTube channel. So, with this COVID pandemic, teachers are now advised or encouraged to use different strategies or ways for online discussion because perhaps students are not allowed, although there is no still no, um, formal announcement or memorandum coming from the Department of Education that there will be no physical or classes to be conducted in the classroom but uh, quite sure that there will be online classes to be conducted so this is also uh, to ensure that COVID or the coronavirus disease will be prevented or the virus will be prevented from transmitting from one person to another person as we all know that this can be transmitted through close contact so social or physical distancing is advised so in order to prevent that one online classes uh, are to be conducted so for this vlog or for this video mga kadasig, I'll be teaching you on how especially sa ato ang mga teachers on how to record uh, discussions using a quick time player and of course presenting your PowerPoint slides so please do not forget to subscribe and like this video and watch this video till the end of the presentation so Okay. Then sa others or other there so makikita nyo yung quick time player so all you have to do is to click this one but since I have clicked or opened that one already so ito na yung uh, appear sa screen so quick time player so mga kadasig for those who are listening to me or watching to me right now please bear with me if you can hear uh, background noise because I'm just recording this presentation or video in my room. So, siguro marinig nyo yung mga manok or a gate is opening or siguro sa motor. So, try to please bear with me. Try to understand lang mga kadasig. So, going back mga kadasig. So, uh, first is you, you will click this one. New movie recording para uh, it will, the, the video will come it will come out or it will show it will be shown here no the, the video so after this one you will click the new screen recording so the new screen recording will record the screen video so if you just click the new movie recording so it will be just this one ang mare record Okay, and not the screen. But if you will also click the new screen recording, everything that you will do in your screen will be recorded. So after that one, is you go to, uh, I'll go back to Quick Time Player. So you go to View, then you click this float on top. Okay, so this video, your video, will be shown or ma appear sa sa top ng yung presentation on top of your presentation and this button here is the button that you will click that you will click once you you stop your video recording so it is advisable mga kadasig for for us teachers para tuloy-tuloy ang ating discussion and uh, para ma may include lahat ng mga things that you want to discuss. It is advised na to have a, what we call this, a cue card or a script for every. If you are used to discuss na, or if you are an expert with your presentation, I'm quite sure that most of you here are experts na in your own field. So, Maybe you can discuss kahit na walang cue cards or script. But for the new teachers, okay, para ma-discuss nyo yung mga things that you need, no, that 
essential sa discussion is it is advised to have a cue card okay para sa re para sa discussion is ma-discuss niyo lahat okay so this button again this button here is the button that you will click once uh stop na ang recording so for this video here actually you can drag this you can resize okay so this is actually mga kadasig the button that you need to press you need to press or you will press once uh you will choose the movie recording but since we are recording this a screen so it's the screen recording okay and one thing mga kadasig is of course actually you can see but in front of me i have a uh, a light no para uh, presentable or hindi ka black okay tingnan sa recording okay or dili madilim tingnan sa recording so you can resize this one but up to this size only so this one so so if you will start uh, your discussion okay so actually i have opened naman the presentation let's say you want to discuss okay about introduction to applied economics so as you can see since we clicked uh, a while ago makadasig the float on top unless if you will have a full view of this presentation your video will appear but if not if this is this will be the type of presentation uh this video will uh, can be seen no? all throughout the presentation okay so so let's say introduction to applied economics so you can move your video here on top no to this side to the other side at the bottom of the screen or even to the other side okay so you can adjust wherever uh you want to place your video mga kadasi. okay so let's say introduction to applied economics so okay dear learners so for for this afternoon or for today we'll be discussing on the topic introduction to applied economics so i am your teacher i'm kelly thomas b tadena so a senior high school teacher at Maslow National High School. So that's what we always do on the first day of our of the class, right? Kadasig. So introduction and so on and so forth. So you can still move your presentation. Next slide. So you have here the subject description. So quarter one. So what are the topics that I'll discuss? So because for me I I share to my learners at the outset of my discussion the the topic so that they will have advanced reading or advanced research on the different topics that the, they need to learn okay but if you want to have a full view of this powerpoint presentation you can just again click no mga kadasig this uh, slideshow presentation but the video cannot be seen anymore oh, okay there see uh, there so at least uh, there is there is the video okay content standard performance standard so at least hindi mabuburingan yung mga learners nyo mga kadasig because makikita nila kayo dyan sa uh, video sa clip no okay so there but if you want to have a what they call this a video presentation so actually i think you know already on how to do hyperlink but if you know uh, if you do not know so maybe i can have another presentation for that using uh for the hyperlink videos so for this presentation i don't have a hyperlink so i'll just present uh this video let's say this is related to the topic so all i have to do is to play so the video okay now uh, nawala yung video ko because i'll be playing a video so all you have to do is to play that video okay 
slide. I'm going to move through this material a little bit more quickly with you than that. Okay. So there, mga kadasik. But if you will not uh, have a full screen of this one, so makikita pa rin yung video nyo. Okay, so there, we have the video presentation, the PowerPoint presentation. And uh, if you want to have, mga kadasig, uh, further readings or a, a website that you want your students to read, actually, you can open, still open the website here. Okay, let's say this one. Okay. Let's say this app.nova.edu. And you can still do the discussion. So, so I'll maximize this one. Your video cannot be seen. But still, you can have a discussion. So, this is recorded. This is recorded. So, once you're done with the discussion, you wrap up your discussion, you give your activity to your students or the things that they need to comply with or submit on the following day or following session. So after that one, you click this one. You click this one, mga kadasig, and it's done. Okay? So there you have it, mga kadasig. We're done with our video presentation. So I'll just make this bigger. Okay, so uh, I just need to introduce my my brother here. Yeah. He's Andre, and he's into like he wants to have online teaching. mga kadasi. say hi. Hello. Okay. Say. Uh, <laughs> okay. So so do not forget to uh, subscribe, mga kadasig. Okay. So, again, uh, advice is you can have your own YouTube channel. You, you uh, create your own YouTube channel and maybe you will upload or yes, you upload your YouTube videos in your channel and you will just ask the link or copy the link and ask your students to view your discussion in the YouTube channel at least ma review nila many times. Okay? So, if you find this uh, presentation very uh, interesting or uh, will help you in the future, please do not forget to subscribe. And if you have something to suggest or comment, write it in the comment section below. And if you are using, actually, you can also use a cell phone, mga kadasig. And if you want to use that cell, your cell phone, you can download the KineMaster app which I have made already a video about that one. So just click the link of that video in the description box. So do not forget to subscribe and like this video mga kadasig and see you in my next video. Dagang salamat! Bye! Kadasig, do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and click the bell button for notifications and like this video. Dagang salamat!